one thing, we will never buy a used RV. As most of you know, this will be our first motorhome and we are now buying used. So first of all, the RV that we were interested in was out of state. We went online and first searched for RV inspectors to see if there was something that even existed. And we ended up stumbling on the NRVIA's website and there was a whole listing of certified inspectors across the country. We found a company in Ohio called Criterion RV Inspections. Kenny contacted them by phone and spoke with the owner, Rick Amos, and he explained to him that we were first time RV buyers. There was an RV near his location and we were interested in having him inspect this for us. We then contacted the dealer who was selling the RV and asked if they would be okay with a third party inspector looking over the RV for us. They were. They said that they had thoroughly looked it over already, but had no issue with us having a third party take a look at it. The dealer was very helpful setting up the day, time, and also having the RV ready with hookups for the inspection to take place. We later found out that Criterion spent somewhere between eight and nine hours on the inspection and it was very thorough. And we'd like to share what they found with you and show how detailed this report was. Looking through the report, we realized just how important the third party inspection was as Criterion found several things that were in need of repair that I don't think we would have even noticed or even how to check if we did know about them. So this is just a copy of our report that we just wanted to show you guys. And as you can see, there are so many different sections that Criterion was inspecting when they went to look at the RV. The inspection was so detailed, as we mentioned, it even included the recalls for the electrical system, powertrain, structure for this particular RV. It included photos of the RV, things that were in need of repair. Even something so small as a roof vent that wouldn't open was labeled here and pointed out to us. And as you can see, checklists across the board for what sort of condition everything was in. Everything from the engine to the chassis to the tires with even a nail noted in one of the tires. Such a detailed report. Something so small in our minds as a bathroom towel ring that needed to be tightened on the wall was noted during this inspection. So overall, again, just a very detailed, helpful report, checking all these things that we wouldn't have even considered looking at or checking kitchen outlets, anything like this. Like this was so, this was so helpful and so important for us to do and made us feel a million times better about purchasing a used RV.